streets Jamming to my dubstep beats Rawr, should've died a sore Shorty hand me my bra sore oh, now he's eating you Oh fuck, now he's trying to eat me too Yeah, right, I'm a robot guy Shoot lasers out of my eyes The dingleberry says to me Shut the fuck up Capcom just just fucked up on their order for Resident Evil 6 on the demo. And wait, what the fuck? Oh shit. Alright. Guess the double review can't hurt any much. <sighs> Gre greetings, fellow gamers. I'm Dragon Patrick, and my job is to destroy shitty games. Just like these two pieces of horrible disfigured mess. There is no doubt how how can movies can be real bad, but movies can be good, but games can either be a little bit good, but also could be fucking horrible. Just like the Hulk. Now, just before we go on off the subject, this is based on Ang Lee's Hulk, not the Incredible Hulk. The Incredible Hulk came out like a few years like, way before the 2003 version, which was a god-awful piece of shit. Now, the one reason I don't understand is how you can fuck up on a kind of game like this. Like, it feels like that you're locked on a grid. That's it. The game is nothing like the movie. At all. And also... You think that this Wolverine game will be kind of cool because it has Wolverine in it. Wolverine, bitches! Until you take a look at the cover, it has an offer to Baskin Robbins. I'm not fucking joking. Take a look. See that right there? Baskin Robbins. 
Can you fucking believe that? One of the most badass Marvel vil I mean heroes and has become like one of the greatest he Marvel heroes to ever exist. And played by Hugh Jackman. Hugh Jackman is as Wolverine is badass. You can't recast him. He's a perfect choice. But a game of both there's not been only one or two or three but four four X Men video games. Only one of them happens to be good. Origins Wolverine. Even though the movie is half and half, the game happens to be like what Wolverine should should be like. Going around murdering people with your claws. And also, there's why there why is there no reason for why can you fuck up on that idea? It's rated T. Yeah, any kid will buy it. Like any kid will watch like a great Marvel movie. Will just buy their shit. Yeah. Does that sound like a company that sounds familiar? A company that kind of made the Resident Evil games and also made also the the Mega Man video games. Oh yeah, Capcom. Well, like Crapcom. Now I'm trying to say is I don't hate Capcom. I'm just saying that they need to they need to stop make. They need to stop doing their stupid shit. Yeah. Shortest explanation ever. Now back on to the review. <laughs> Both of these two games... What's the point? Why bother with them? They're just movie license games. Of course they're gonna suck. I had these, like... I found these, like, dorm, like... Well, I was going through my closet, or, like, a stuff in there, but, like, I, I replayed these two games, and they've been both terribly awful. Awful. So, time to do only one thing. So, that was two busted, thousand more to go. I'm Dragon Patrick, and you're watching me on Patrick Walden's channel.